Welcome to thetechnologycloset.com and our quick shots. Today we're going to show you how to disable the USB ports in your Windows 8 machine using the regedit command. This is done primarily to prevent infections by malware via the USB uh, stick, hard drive, etc. To do that, we'll have to open up the desktop. From the desktop, we want to open up the run box. Windows key plus R. Type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T, and enter. This will bring up the registry editor. From the registry editor, we're going to have to maneuver down to a particular area in the registry. Here's where we have to go. So we start out at the H key local machine. We select system, expand it. We select current control set, expand it. We select services, expand it, and scroll all the way down to USB store. There we go. Under USB Store, we're going to select Start. Double click on it. It comes up with a hexadecimal value. Note the value. This is the default value. It's 3. And change it to 4. Before we do this, though, let me show you that I have a USB device attached to the system. We'll scroll down here to the removable device. And as you can see, <clears throat> pardon me, we're in removable disk E, and we also have some files in it. I can actually take this file, for example, and I can copy it to my desktop. As you can see, the file is now on my desktop. Now I'm going to click on the start again. I'm going to change the value to 4. Select OK. Close down the editor and restart the system to, for that to take effect. So we're going to restart. Now we have restarted our system. I'm going to again display the USB device. If it's there, let's see. Open up my computer. I see my local hard drive. I see a DVD but I do not see a USB device. Yet the USB device is plugged into our system. This, in effect, hides the USB device and makes it inaccessible to users. You can't plug it in, you can't see it, you can't read it. There is one drawback to this. If the USB device is auto-run and you have not disabled auto-run in Windows 8, this could still infect your system. Well, that's it for this quick shot. Please visit our website at thetechnologycloset.com. And while you're there, click on the button and visit our YouTube channel. Until next time.